somebody's been living in here. Yeah, man. Shit, think they're gone? I hope so, but this looks recently used. Be on the lookout and have your guard up. A clipboard. map of where the train goes. I think these tracks might lead to the coast. Route 27, Savannah. That's where Kinney's got us headed. I'll take this to Kanja for Doc. Switch. Nothing. Got one. Walker, sitting in the chair. We got him. <laughs> Suppose we gotta look him over. Yeah. I don't think this guy came back. Christ. That light is blinking. Push it. Push it? Why not? Are you fucking serious? Here, look. It's just the brakes. Okay, I'll give you that one. This fucker works? Seems like it. I'll be damned. How the hell do we get it moving? I don't know. That's Mr. Amtrak over here. No clue. We found this in the boxcar back there. Whoa, is this what it looks like? I think so. This horse will take us right to Savannah. A hundred tons of steel. Put a thousand walkers between us and the ocean, and we don't have to give a shit. 
I can't believe it. I wouldn't mind plowing through some walkers. That's the spirit. Try to get this thing started. There's got to be some sort of manual or something. <laughs> I don't know about that. Van, if you could keep an eye on the girls and duck, I'd appreciate it. I'm gonna make sense of these controls. Man, this could be exactly what we need. A bunch of maps about Georgia cities. Nothing about the train. Shit, this is it. Instructions on starting the engine. Damn, pages are gone. I can kind of see the indentations from the writing. Ugh. Things were designed to save lives. This door's gonna hurt. Okay, you aren't gonna like this. in pretty good shape for a wreck. We got a problem. What? We still got the rest of the train attached to us back there. Shit. I tried the ink to pin out, but it won't budge. Well, we ain't going anywhere until it does. There's a notepad on the train. Do you have any pencils or anything in your pack? No, I wish. Maybe in the RV. What do you need it for? There used to be something written on the notepad that I need to know about. Well, if you're not using it, I'd take it. I'm out of paper, and there's all sorts of new leaves around here. We found a notebook that we think might have had some starter directions on it, but the page is missing. Well, I'm sure you guys will figure it out. Would you have left Lily back there? On the side of the road like that? Yes, Lee. Yeah? We have to have lines. Yes, I would have left her. Okay, then. Has Clementine said anything to you about Carly or Duck or anything? I'm worried about her. No. That little girl is a puzzle. Yeah, she is. 
Poor Carly. God, where did yesterday go? I don't know. Are you okay? I know you were fond of her. I was. This isn't any time for, you know, romance, but yeah. I was, uh, fond of her, yeah. How's that? I don't know. Tired. Which could mean a lot of things, right? Yeah. His body's probably fighting whatever's in it. Exactly. Anyway, let me know if anything changes here. Is Ken all right? What is he doing? He's put his mind to figuring out the train. What about you? Same thing, sort of. I found some instructions, but I can't read them. Oh. Well, I'm sure someone can help you. Here, found some water. Oh, thank you. Perfect. He's allergic to bees. Is that right? It's all I can keep thinking about. Somehow that matters. It doesn't. I know. Well, I don't. But you're probably right. Here, I found this. If Duck's up for it. Thank you. That's very thoughtful. He isn't fussy, you know. What? Most kids, they're really fussy about what they'll eat. Hate vegetables, that kind of thing. Not Duck, huh? No. The most trouble I ever have is making him use a fork. Thank you, Lee. Sure. Hey, sweet pea. You okay out here? I don't think Duck feels good. Uh, me neither. Definitely pry this thing free, if I can break it loose first. Hey, kid. What's up? You want to talk about Duck? I'm really sorry, kitty. Nobody deserves this. There's nothing to talk about. You heard Cat. He could be fine. We probably shouldn't ignore that. Nobody's ignoring nothing. I'm not worried. You shouldn't be either. God, we need some help getting this train going. People take notes, right, when working on stuff like this? We're smart guys. We can figure it out. I don't know about leaving Lily back there. Abandoning someone on the side of the road is the same as murder. Don't worry about it. We just would have had to deal with her eventually. I'll get back to it. Me too. Nothing about the train.
perfect. You can read it now? Yeah. Should be able to just follow the steps to get the engine on. Sounds good. Son of a bitch! Whatever you did, lit the dash up! So far, so good. Now we're talking. Shit! We're golden! This thing is loud. So what? We're barreling down the tracks at 40 miles an hour. I don't care about the noise. Let's fucking enjoy this. Mom, let's see if she'll move. It's all yours. Attached. Can you go find out where we're stuck and get us unstuck? Yeah. Hey, Kenny, we're loose. You touch any of my stuff? I took the map of the train routes. That's fine. You can have that. Really? Yeah. I got them all right up here. I guess it's no worse for wear. Name's Chuck. Charles, if you fancy. Lee. Is that your crew outside? Yeah. And the guy up in the cab? Him, too. I saw you walking through here and thought about scaring the pants off you. What? But I couldn't force myself to do it. You're still kind of freaking me out. Train folk will do that. Already met everyone outside. They all warmed to me right quick in direct sunlight. You met Chuck? Yeah, I did. It's so nice to meet someone normal for a change. He gave us candy, Ben too. Welcome. Thank you. 
You met Kenny? Sure did. Man shares my love of the road. That's for certain. Sorry, your son's not feeling good. I appreciate your concern. Well, with a little TLC, I'm sure he'll be fit as a fiddle in no time. And I can offer y'all whatever I got, although it ain't much. Thank you. We'd like to do the same. Why don't we hold off on the... Stay with us. We'd like the company. So that's it? We're cut loose? Seems that way, yeah. Great. We don't got much left, so just gather whatever you have. Wanna ride? Well, it sounds like you're taking my home. That's a yes, then. And find anything better for keeping the creepy crawlies out than that boxcar. Duck's sick. Get on the train, Clementine. He's getting sicker. Let me look at him. We can't ignore this. Look at the kid, Kenny. This is happening. Ain't shit happening. And if it were, what can we do here? We get on the train and we find something better. That is the plan. I think Lee just wants to talk it through. It's talked through! Get on, Kent. I'll be up front. I don't want to hear any nonsense until we get where we're going. Gotta be hard on you, eh? Three adults taking care of three kids. No disrespect, son. There were more of us. Dad, get them. Yes. Oh, it's a shame. Lee! Lee, I need you right now. I need you to go get Ken. What's up? Would you get that off his face? My hands are full here. Thank you. Could you just get that off his face, please? He's out of time. We need to stop this train. Okay. I'm gonna go get Kenny. Hold on tight in case the train stops fast. I wanna get this train stopped right quick. Stopping the train. Stay put. Okay. You need to... 
to stop the train. Kenny. What? Ken. What the hell's that? Your son's blood. Get out of here, Lee. You know he's dying. Nobody knows shit. He'll be fine. He won't be. He's going, Kenny. What is the goddamn deal? He's a little sick, but we can't just quit. It's a scratch. He's not like the others. Jesus, all y'all are just making it worse. Stop the train. Stop it, goddammit! Fuck you, Lee. You're gonna listen. Or what? Calm down and... How the fuck do you calm down after a day like today? By talking to your friend. Think you're the reason Duck was bitten? Like you had this coming or something? You didn't kill Herschel's son. Yes, I did. And now it's catching up to me. That's not what went down. You looked out for your kid. A bad thing happened to someone else's. There ain't no way this world lets my son live when I help put someone else's in the ground. That's not the way it works. I know that. Stop the train, man. And it's... I think it's time. The boy's been bit, in case you haven't figured that out. What do you need? I... I... Gotcha. It's time to... This is not possible. What are we going to do? We can't allow him to become one of those things. But what if... what if he doesn't? Kenny, I love you very much. I love our son more than life itself. I need you to hear me. What you are saying, that he may not turn, is foolish. But... No. There's... Come on, Cap. If you think of one, you let me know. Isn't there some sort of pill or something we can just give him? Stop it. Just drift off to sleep. Right, hon? I mean, Jesus, this is our son. I know. But we know it's here or nothing. Oh, fuck. Just who, then? You want me to? You don't have to. I'll do it. No. It should be a parent. No parent should have to do something like this. Lee's right, Cat. We can say our goodbyes and just let that be it. I don't know. Lee, you'd be doing this family a great service. Why don't we take him into the forest so Clementine doesn't have to see? Yeah. Give us a moment to say goodbye. Of course. Duck is dying. I know. What are you 
you doing? I'm putting him out of his misery. Oh. Yeah. Look, Clem. Things are... What the... No! Ben, take Clementine into the train. Go. It'll be fine. Cat! Cat! Gotcha! Why? Cat! Honey! Oh, fucking God! <laughs> what the hell happened? What did you... She could... She, 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 she just... Oh, oh, oh fuck! Give me the gun, kid. I'll do it. Understand what happened? Yes. Okay. What do you think it's about? What Chuck said. What Chuck say? That what happened to Duck would happen to me. The fuck he did. I swear. Sorry. I took some sense into it. Don't be mad. Hey. How you doing? care what reason you had for doing it. No reason to go and tell my girl she's gonna end up dead. Because she is. I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. If y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do you know? I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah, and then what? Do what's best for Clementine. Oh, well, then, you do have it all figured out. Never mind. Look, sit down with the girl and hash it out. Find a map, for Christ's sake. I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you... It won't. If it were, you gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. I'm not a barber. 
It ain't gotta be style, but Jesus. You got her running around with a mop that's gonna act like Velcro to any hand swinging its way. Find some scissors in my pack and take care of that hair before Walker does it for you. And then show her how to use a gun. Because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. Okay. Explain to her how they work and not to be afraid. I don't mean to tell you how to do your job. But too many people have died already. They have. And seeing another little girl die might just do me in. I hear you. A plan, a haircut, and a gun. It's good advice. It's something. I shot the kid, you know. I suppose someone had to. What a mess. You said it. You have any family? Out there, somewhere. Been sort of on my own for the past, oh, 14 years now. Sorry to hear that. No one to blame. You're homeless then? Eh, suppose. I've had homes here and there, and well, they just don't work out. I like a drink, you know? Yeah. Got any? No. Darn. Where are you headed? Uh, that way. I mean when we get to Savannah. Got a few ideas. We'll have a talk when we get there about whether or not you folks want company. Be safe up here. You betcha. 